ricchi nel mondo tra le donne sono soltanto Whitney Houston e Madonna. Che cosa pensa Whitney Houston di Madonna e del successo straordinario del suo tour dell'anno scorso? Well, I think that uh, I have a lot of respect for Madonna. Um, she works hard at what she does. And I think that anybody that um, works as hard as Madonna does, or works as hard as I do, deserves everything that they get. And that's how I feel about Madonna. And that damn bodyguard soundtrack, is that still in the chart? <laughs> I remember that I opened up Billboard magazine and my song had dropped to number three and Whitney Houston's had gone to number one. And then I went down to my voice teacher's, um, her studio where I take lessons, and I walked in and she was humming Whitney Houston's song. And I was devastated. This is what I'm dreaming about. Whitney Houston and Mariah Carey are doing a duet. You're lying. They are. It's oh. true. So how, how, who do you think should get top billing? Um, I think Whitney, because she's been around longer. Superiority. Mm. Type of thing. <laughs> One last question, the lady was standing up. Hello, Whitney. Hi. Um, in regards to your daughter, um, with so many things that we've seen in videos, like in, in the past with Madonna wearing her, you know, cone-shaped metal bra, oh. um, when, when your daughter gets to, you know, age 12 or 13, and she asks questions, are you glad you never did anything like that? So are you glad that, you know, you're not going to have to explain anything like that to her? <laughs> well, I be glad that I won't have to explain that I wore cone-shaped bras and stuff like that. I know, there was but that there are other though, things in life a little more most... important to, to be real with her about. I mean, that's an image. I, I know Madonna, I met her myself, and she doesn't wear those every day. <laughs> you know, so, you know, that is definitely an image. I just want Chrissy to know the difference between what's real and what's not. The wisdom to know the difference is the most important to me with her. None of your business. Still. So this was probably the wrong time to ask her how it felt to be hooking up with producer Babyface again after Madonna had just scored a diva smash of her own with him. Before Madonna, it was Face and I. Okay. Do I have to say any more? <laughs> Madonna is the legend forever and always, okay? Learn it. The reigning diva as the year began was without question Madonna, although of course she's always been more than just a diva. Oh my God, how crazy. I mean, yeah. But that was the 80s, you know what I'm saying? I look at myself, I look at Madonna, I look at Prince, I look at Michael, I look at all of us and I go, you know, we had costumes. They weren't scary. It was that we were performers, performing, you know what I'm saying? Um, having artistry is one thing, but being dark and just like, you know, different weird stuff is not a becoming to, I don't know, to me, it's not becoming at all.